все. Hi, yeah. Hi, Tony. How are you? Not too bad. Good. Good. Morning today, isn't it? All set for today then? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so last week we just touched on the turn in the road at the end of the lesson, didn't we? we so did, we didn't yeah. do much yeah. on it. Yeah. So how do you feel it went? Um It was very similar to the reverse round the corner we'd done on the previous lesson, wasn't it? Yeah. Um I had to have control, observations and accuracy, didn't I? Yes. Um I had, a, I had a bit of a job judging when to stop. I kept bouncing off the curb either side, didn't I? Mm-hmm. Yeah? So, how are you going to prevent yourself from doing that today? Um, I think it's a better question than that because I wouldn't be able to answer that one. You'll be able to answer that. So, so, um... How much? So, how much help are you going to need to stop doing that today? I have to stop twice, haven't I? On either side. What do you mean you've got to stop twice? Um, I have to judge when to take the steers off. Yep. And then I have to judge when to stop so I don't overhang the curb. Yep. Yeah? Okay, yes. Yeah? Yep. What's this? Okay. So, when we get to the first reference point, yeah, we're not going to be too far away from the curb, are we? No, we're you're going. Go, you're, go, you're going to have to tell the student when to stop here. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I can't see There's a windy thing at the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So when we get to the first reference point, we're going to go roughly about that that far forward, Tony. Okay. That's a lot better than a bit, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yes. And if I hear the word a bit, a bit coming out, you see that tree there? I'll be round that tree, won't I've I? Got, I've got a rope in the boot, yeah? I'll turn the camera off so it doesn't look like a... You'll hang me from it. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to do the turn around and you're going to stop that far from the curb. Right, so... Let's go through your routine, yeah? Remember about your responsibility so, as a driver? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um do we go so we're doing the turn in the road. So we're gonna work on that today then. Yeah. And then so and who's responsible would for Would you it? like to work on that today? Would you like to work on that today? I would, today? Yeah. 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 So t could you sort of scale how far you think you got last week if one was not very good and ten was good? Excellent. Uh, about four, I kept About it, four. I kept bouncing them curves. Well that's side, about yeah, that would be about right because we'd only just really started on it, haven't we? So what would you like to be by the end of today? Be ten eventually. Exactly. So we're gonna aim for that today? Yeah. Okay, so who's responsible just reminding me, Tony, who's responsible for everything inside and outside the car? I am. You are. Good. Yeah. Okay. So and obviously, um you no, understand not obviously obvious there's anyway. nothing obvious at all, but yeah. when we're doing the manoeuvres, Tony, if I feel that you're not quite um how much help are you gonna want from me? Uh, could you help me with the um the reference point for, uh, for stopping? With the reference points for stopping okay so we'll do that and then see how we get on and if i feel that for some reason you're not yeah hang on a second yeah you're, you're rushing into it too quick you stop stop and take a breath engage your brain first yeah yeah so you want to help me to know yeah. when to stop i'm waiting for you to i'm going to get a great big notice in this car <laughs> listening skills yeah <laughs> yes so how much responsibility have you asked me how much responsibility I'm willing to take? Not really, you just said that you wanted me no. to help you stop. No, have you asked me? So, no. So how much responsibility do you want in the manoeuvre I, I felt fine with the control. Yep. Because it was similar to the reverse around the corner. Yep. Um, I felt fine with the, with the observations. Yes. Um, But the accuracy I confused me a bit. So it's just, just you're just going too far before you stop. Yeah. Okay, so you want to help me with that? You want me to help you with that? So come on, make it 
make it clear this is really important so that I know what I'm responsible for you know what okay, you're responsible so for. So you're responsible for the controls. Are you are you willing to take this is client said learning isn't it? Yeah yeah. Yeah it's I'm not normally okay on that. Yeah it's not it's not it's not telling them what we're responsible for. Are they okay with taking responsibility? So are you okay with that amount of responsibility? Today? What responsibility? What you just told me. You said you were okay, you were fine with the controls and the accuracy. No, uh, no I wasn't fine with the accuracy. You weren't fine with the stuff, you were fine with the steering and the controls. I was fine and with the observations. The, I was fine with the control and the observations. So that's the speed and the observations, but yeah. you weren't happy about your accuracy as when to stop and to manoeuvre. Is that what you meant? I think so, yeah. Okay. So how much help would you like from me so to are you, you? Are you what? Are you fine with that amount of control? Are you okay with taking the responsibility for the control and the, and the observations? So are you fine with taking the responsibility with the control and the observations? I am, yeah. yeah. You're fine with that? Yeah. Okay. So, um, and as far as the accuracy is concerned, how much help and would you like from me? What do you get out of clause? What do you get out of clause? So if I feel that you're not responding, you're not coping with the situation as I'd like, um, you're happy with me to you'll understand that I will step in verbally or potentially use the pedals. If I, if I put us or anybody in danger. So, yeah. The get out clause is that you're coming either verbally or, or with the pedals. Physically with the or with physically with control, the pedals. Yeah? yeah. Okay. So I've got to start all that again. No, and what help are you going to give me? So what help would you like me to give you? The accuracy. The accuracy. Yeah. So when you say accuracy, you'd like me to help you as when to stop? Yeah. To change your manoeuvre? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So, when we turn in the road, Tony, so how many... So, when we're going round the first section of the turn, so how many stops do you have to do? So go through with me again what you felt that you've got to do. Can you remember the manoeuvre? You said two last week. And what are those two stops? So that you're aware of them. Um. You didn't say I had to stop, but you said it would probably be a good idea to stop and try and pick, pick up a reference point for when I need to take the steering off. Yep, and turn it back. And then I had to go forward a certain amount, and then you would tell me when to stop again, mm -hmm. but I kept hitting the curb. Right, okay. So, and when you're ready, do you want to do your observations and we'll get on? I've got my seatbelt on, sorry, already. Okay, so wait. Pardon? I want you to wait here. I want you to do all your observations. Well, what have you not done? So think of your palm. Prepare. Observe. Well, that's my that's my um, responsibility bit going out the window, isn't it? No, because you didn't check over your shoulder or anything. So I'm reminding you. Why don't you just put it in the gear? All right, okay. I'll let you do it then. Is it okay to go now? It's okay to go now. Okay, nice. Okay, I want you to stop there. I stopped. Yeah. Now, so what's the next manoeuvre you have to do? You said to be ready to go. So you need to st to move forward a little bit, Daniel. How am I going to know where to stop the on the next one? You got your reference point. Not without you asking me. So what's your reference point here then, Tony? What reference point? So I want you to choose a reference point. Do you want me to get a measure? No, visually. Where does the curb appear to cut into the car? Where does the curb appear to cut into the car? Just ahead of the door mirror. Okay, so that's your reference, first reference point. For? For your neck, for, for your turn in the road. For what? That's your reference point for when, when for we start moving, you start taking some steering wheel. So that's your reference point for when we start moving again to start turning the steering wheel. To steer back. Okay, so, so now. Yeah, I can remember how to control the speed here. Yep. Uh, it's gravity in it. Okay, and then we'd stop there. So you've got the next reference point, so where does the curve cut in now? 
It looks like the door mirror is actually on the curb. Okay, so there you go. So your first reference point is in front of the door mirror and your second reference point is by the curb. So you could have helped me slightly there. Where were they? Nothing. The first reference point, yeah? yeah. You could have said to me, I want you to just go forward about that far to get to the second reference point. Oh, right, okay. Yeah? Yeah. You make eye contact with him, he'll sit there all day. Make eye contact with him. What's the routine he use? POM. POM. Tell me what POM means. Prepare, observe, manoeuvre. Alright. Am I prepared? Yeah. Am I? No, because you're not in reverse. So why are you doing now? You're confusing him, aren't you? Yeah. You're still looking at him, aren't you? I'm not going to look at him. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to look at Don't him. Don't forget, you're the instructor. If he sees you look around, he yeah, just look straight forward. forward there, yeah? If he sees you look around, he probably thinks you told me to start carrying on. Right, okay. Has he got loads of room to go around with if he wants to? No. Well, he has. He has, yeah. And he's still not going. Would you like me to wave him on? No, I don't. Yeah, see so the car behind has gone round, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah. So why hasn't he gone round? He has now. Has he? I'm not going to look. The reason why he didn't go round to begin with, mm -hmm. eye contact. Okay. Yeah? Really important, isn't it? So don't look at them. Well, think what POM means. Uh-huh. Yeah? Yep. No good medium POM if my instructor is, uh Doing it. He's doing the old first, yeah? Look at me, you're going backwards now. Got to check all around me. And you said, start this side with the pavement. Mm hmm Nobody there. Nobody coming down the road. No. Nope. Nobody walking in front of me in case I roll. No. Nope. Nobody coming in to, up the road. Uh-huh. Uh, nobody okay. behind me. No. Okay. So, and now what's important when you're reversing to, to do what with your observations? Oh, uh, I thought I had responsibility for that. You do have responsibility, so you, you carry call, on. Call, you don't like giving responsibility, do you? No, I don't. And then you said, when my body's about halfway across, look that way. I'll be me. This is the bit I'm not sure of. Okay, so now you stop there. Oh, I've stopped. Okay, good. Now I want you to wait here. Yeah, I've stopped. I know, so what's your reference point in your door mirror? Door mirror? So what's your reference point to look at? So you can use your mirrors to find your reference point, no? Why don't you let me pick the reference point, yeah? Okay. You're going to have pupils from all different sizes. Right, okay. Sitting close to the wheel, sitting right back nearly in the back seat, yeah? Yeah. Where does the curb appear to cut into the car? Okay, that's the reference point every time. So, can you choose, can you see a reference point? So what? I'm asking you to see it now. So where does the curb cut into the car, Tony? Ahead of me. No, back. Oh, right. you know. It looks like it's just by that no smoking sticker. Okay, so I want you to move about that distance. What's that reference point for? That's that reference point is the first reference point to stop to then change your steering. Oh. Okay? Yeah. So, I want you to move the distance of that to, to turn your steering back. Check it all round. Okay. Well, keep an eye on them too on the bikes. Yeah, keep an eye on them. Well, get close. That's it, and then you stop there. All right. Okay? Yeah. And then you do your observations again. No, what do you do now? I kept hitting the curb last week. Have you hit the curb? No. So that's good, isn't it? Yeah, but how will I be? How will I be able to do it on my own on the next lesson? Because you're going to use the same reference points as you've used today. I haven't got a reference point. You have. What's the reference point now? Now that you stood back. What do you mean a reference point? What so you when you stopped, you used it and you said the curb was cutting in just by the no smoking signal. Oh, now it's cutting in the corner of the storm mirror here. So there you go. So uh, there. Yeah, the door window. Sorry. So there's your two reference points. So your when you reverse back. What's the second reference point? So the reference point to know that that when you've done your steering there to stop. Yeah. And um, what's that reference point for? To stop so that you're ready to go forward. What do you mean? What's the, you know the re first reference point was when you reverse. Would it back. be really bad? If, let her roll. Would it be really bad? Will you stop looking around you? Yeah. Would it be really bad if I mounted a curb? and went onto the pavement? Yes! What's that reference point for then? So that you don't mount the curb and go onto the pavement? Or don't even know behind the curb? 
What's the danger of overhanging the curb? Have we hit anything that was behind you? Yeah. Damage to the car and hitting people, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Brilliant. You have to do this in three, haven't you? No. Oh. Um, oh, I've got to check all around me, haven't I? Mm-hmm. He looks like he's waiting. He's waiting. And he's waiting. Well done. Shall I stop? Yep, that'd be great. That didn't go too bad, did it? No, I thought you did really well. You understand where I'm coming from about this this POM routine, yeah? Yes. There's there's yeah. there's no good talking about POM. And they don't know what it is, do they? And they're not using it. No. Yeah? So yeah. yeah? That's fine, yeah. You're gonna have chaos on the road, yeah? Yep. Absolutely. No, that's fine. If you're coming up to a junction and you're not sure what a pedestrian's gonna do when you're on driving, yeah? Mm-hmm. What do you do? If you're not sure what? If you're so you not sure about the pedestrians standing on the pavement, what they're going to do. What do you do? You keep watching them. Eye contact. Yeah. That's what you're doing with the drivers. Mm -hmm. That driver on the left there, yeah? Why do you Why do you reckon he waited so long? Because I'd looked round. Yeah. You looked at him, didn't you? Yeah. Why didn't you wave him? Because I thought you'd tell me off if I waved him. Of course I would, yeah. <laughs> There's no way I was waving him to go. No, because you've got no right to. No, exactly. What if you wave them into the path of oncoming traffic? Well, no, I know. Make their own or decisions. you suddenly started reversing. Yeah. yeah let, let them make their own decisions. Yeah. If, we, if we're both looking dead straight forward, they'll have a pretty good idea that I'm not going to sit here waiting, I'm going to go around them, yeah? Yeah. Um, if they're not in a hurry, they'll sit and wait. Yeah. But the range rover behind went, went, it went past, and then a penny dropped. But I'll have to say, I. I think he waited because you looked at him. Do you really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. Because you've done O, P, Not because he's M. just being nice, because I wait for people to do it. Did you look at him? Well, I looked round at the car. I don't know whether I physically... When you looked at him, what do you think he was probably thinking? Thinking that I'm telling him to wait so that you can finish your manoeuvre. He's, he's probably thinking, he's, he's now told that good looking bloke driving that car to start, to start going there, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, which I wouldn't do because that would, uh, you might not be ready to, which you wouldn't be if it was your first time. I wouldn't mind trying that again. That's perfectly fine, I wouldn't mind trying that again either. Speak to me. So, so how do you feel that went, Tony? Yeah, yeah, I, I, I kind of got the hang of that. So, now, how much help would you want from me this time? Can I have a go on my own this time? Yep. Uh, with the accuracy. So what have you got to remember about your accuracy? Your reference points. Your reference points. Yeah. And do you know where they are now? I do, yeah. Okay, yeah. good. I'll take that before you finish it. Yes, good that. Yeah? <laughs> yes. So, so should I have a go? I've got to find something about that long. Yes. <laughs> you know this has gone on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yes. <laughs> like more like bloody porn on dot com. <laughs> okay. Yes. yes. So, so, have no. so have a go on that. Let's have a go and you have a go on your own. Now so what have you got to remember though, Tony? So what have I got to remember? So you're gonna have a go on your own. How much responsibility how much help would you like from me I at said, all? I said I'd like to try it myself. You can do it yourself. So just like to remember that if anything happens and you put us in danger, either of us, I will step in either verbally or by the use of pedals. Oh well, just us. If you feel I have to. And anybody else around oh, us. Right, yeah. Okay. around you once more, I'm going to have a brace <laughs> inserted to stop me doing it, yeah? Okay. Prepare. 
-hmm. You always told me it's really important to prepare yourself first, isn't it? Yes. N never even look around you until you're ready, yeah? Okay. Yeah, I'll start there with the pavement. There's a learner coming down the road, so I'm just going to stop looking at him for a minute. It's my friend Bozzy. Oh, he's waiting for me. I think he's stalled. And behind. Keep an eye on. And then when my body's halfway across the road, I look to the right, don't I? Yep. Remember gravity. Oh, I can see the cigarette sticker. Good. So I'm sticking the opposite way. And there's my second reference point. Excellent. Well done. Don't look around you. You keep telling me, innit? I didn't. Just check around with you to make sure it doesn't roll back. Nobody coming down the road. Nobody on the pavement. And was he's waiting. And a car behind him to wait. Give him a wave. Give him a wave. Now stop on the left. See, was he or not? It's nice to acknowledge people, innit? I, do. I think you did really well. How do you feel you did? I feel that was that was really helpful. It went really well, and you yeah. excellent use of your reference points. Well done. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Okay, so how do you feel that you're happy about that now? Um, on the accuracy bit now, mm -hmm. I'd probably give myself about seven point five. I think so too. Yes. Maybe you an eight. No, well, no, you're seven point five. Seven and a half. Okay, fine. What about everything else? What do you feel so, you need to do to get so a 10? So what do you feel do you need to do to get a 10, Tony? Practice. Exactly. That's all it will take now, isn't it? It's yeah. just practice. Yeah. So a few times at that, and I think you'll have cracked that properly, won't you? Yeah. yeah. Okay, good. So your scale of not 1 to 10 overall, the 7.5, you're happy with that? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay. So would you like to do any more, or are you happy to carry on now? Okay. Fantastic. Well done, Tony. Right, so we're out of roll then. I know. Please, when you're out with your pupils during the weekend, yeah? mm -hmm. stick to your POM routine. Yeah. There's no good you're looking at them. There's nothing you can do about them. Yeah? The only thing you're going to do is you're going to start rushing your pupil. Yeah. And they're going to make it a complete another Yes. Yeah? Um, follow the pom routine. Okay. Right? Yeah. Don't right. start getting into this habit of waving people past. No. Right? It's dangerous. Yeah. Okay. Yeah? Um, you shouldn't even... Don't acknowledge them at all. Don't acknowledge them at all. Don't even look at them. Okay. Once you've looked at them, yeah. they're going to sit and wait. Okay. Yeah? Some of them may go past on, the, on a narrow road. They may even go up on the pavement. That's their business. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. We're the ones doing the silly manoeuvre in the in the road. Yeah, okay. Um, but we have to keep it safe. Yeah. And that and that means don't be confusing other people, yeah? Make right. sense? Yeah, it does to make yeah? sense, yes. Absolutely. I'll oh, just go in there turn these cameras up before you swear anymore. <laughs> I'm trying not to. Bad honest. girl. I really try not to.